Hi, it's John here. I've uh, just been down on the allotment. I've got a lot of spinach. What I'm going to do, I'm going to do a video about freezing spinach. And uh, look at it all. I've got tons of it all here. Now what happened was, about last October time, I was watching Gardener's World and Monty Don said half the spinach. And I didn't really believe it, but I did. Plant it. I did sow, sow the seed. And um, it all worked out well. We didn't really get any over the winter, but um, now in the spring we've got tons of spinach, so I'm going to freeze some down, and um, then that'll be useful when there's no, not that much uh, crops to get from the garden. From these bags, I've got, I would say there's, uh, I'm not very good judge, but about three or four kilograms of uh, spinach here. So I'll go for it now. So what I've decided to do is wash it all in the bath, um, because I can use as much water as I like because I don't have a water meter, I can't fit one here and it does grow fairly near the ground so it does get rather gritty uh, so it'll give a good wash and then I'll just put it in batches in the steamer I think so I filled up the steamer with the spinach I haven't packed it right down because I suppose it's important that the steam should be able to get through the spinach and uh, and um, we've got solar panels here so it is the daytime so we will be generating a little bit of electricity and the sunshine so should be able to um, boil this up for free that's the way I'm going to do it, I'm not going to blanch it, I'm just going to cook it completely and then um, when, when it's defrosted uh, just be able to warm it up or um, do what you like with it so right, I'll uh, put the top on ready for the cooking there we go top on and just put it on a little bit because I've got some other jobs to do while that's boiling up well that's the spinach cooked it's gone down to about one eighth of the volume that it was when I put it in there and uh, what I'm going to do is um, it's also cooled down you know you don't want to be freezing stuff when it's still hot you know you've got to let it cool down before you put it in the freezer so I'm just going to pop all that into a, a freezer bag right, and um, spinach in the freezer bag and this is one of posh freezer bags with a little dip on it now the way I do it is I have a straw just put it in the bag <laughs> it's a bit long straw that one isn't it um, and uh, just draw it and uh, dip it and wrap it like that and as much air out as you can, oh that spinach tastes nice, mm. such as, as much air out as possible, and uh, then now I'll put that in the freezer, so that's bag number one. So the final boiling of spinach we're going to have with our meal tonight, we've got some people coming, but uh, that bowl for there, which is quite a small bowl, that represents um, nearly a third of those two huge bagfuls of spinach I had so the amount of boiling down is amazing um, but I think it's quite nut nutritious I mean Popeye, Popeye used to eat it didn't he and give him su super strength um, so uh, I hope he'll give me super strength yeah so that's good <laughs> um, what else was I going to say I was going to say something else about it um, so I've cut the plants right down now to the ground so I'll see whether whether they come up again and uh, oh I know what I was going to say um, of course there is the, uh, the, the the vegetable water which comes off um, so there's quite it's quite concentrated vegetable water come off of this so I'm going to give that a try and see what that tastes like as well right uh, spinach highly recommend it right bye for now <laughs>